Um, so starting on the B section, everything goes higher uh, quite a bit. So we bring the left hand up to A minor in root position right here where the middle C is. So middle C area. And then when we go to the E, we keep our thumb on the top and we have an E in root position, in a first inversion. So you can use your, your pencil as we talked about last week and just put a slash G sharp under that E. For the next chord, we have a C in second inversion. So you can use your pencil and do a slash G. Then we go to D in first inversion, which is D slash F sharp. And then we're going down to root position F. And then we go up to G root position and A minor. So let's do that, that uh, line again. Again, we talked about this last week. If you want to use this resource of writing the slash uh, to, to signify the inversion, you can do that and it, you might, you, it might be helpful. So let's start there on measure 14. One, two, three, four. One, two, E. C with G on the bottom. D with F sharp on the bottom, F root position, three, four, G and A minor. Okay, I'm gonna play that again now with the melody. I'm gonna start on the pickup to measure 14. I'll count three, start on the pickup to measure 13, uh, 14, and we're gonna do the repeat. One, two, three, Four. check it out. For the C section, the C is asking you to play C in root position. So now we're going to go back down. If you look at the C section, it looks, the chords look exactly the same as the chords in the A section. You see that? The, at least for that first line. So the second line looks exactly the same as the line that starts on measure 18. So we're going to use the same chord inversions there as well. So let's go for measure 18. One, two, three, four. F over C. One more time. Measure 18. One, two, three, four. And then 
and check it out. The last line is the exact same line as the line that starts on measure 14. So that's why now we're calling that section B again, because it's a reprise of the B section. Uh, so let's do the following. Let's start now from measure 14, and we're just going to play straight through to the end. And you see there on measure 22, the second to last line, I didn't write the inversions there because it's actually exactly the same course as, me, uh, as the line on measure 10, so you can just use the exact same inversions. You can and you should, actually. I should say you should, not you can. So let's go for measure 14, and we're going to do the repeat and get to the end. One, two, three. Two. 